My beautiful wife, Jess and I, are settling the debate that we have had since we got married six years ago, which is who is smarter? We're doing that by taking an IQ test today. Who do you think is gonna win? You're more book smart, and I feel like I'm more street smart. Absolutely. And I don't know what an IQ test gauges. You know, like if we were taking a school test, like the SAT for all my fellow Americans, if we were taking the SAT, you would for sure crush me in the SAT. I don't know. Let's remember, you are two years older than me. Wow, okay. No, that's meant to be a compliment. Oh, yeah, yeah, that would, you're just calling me old. <laughs> so according to Google, most people, about 68%, have an IQ between 85 and 115. Only a small fraction of people have a very low IQ, below 70, or a very high IQ, above 130. The average IQ in the United States is 98. Mm. There's a cool little graph here that I have. 98 is pretty accurate based off this thing. This one says 100s right down the middle, but then like it's the even bell curve spread. So based off of this, where do you think you're gonna end up? Oh my gosh, shouldn't we write it down? Jess is gonna write her guess for herself and for me. I'm gonna write my guess for myself and for me. Well, don't look. Okay, sorry, I have to close my eyes. You know what this frame reminds me of? In the office when Michael's going like. Okay. Now I'm gonna write mine. Don't look. Oh, sorry. Don't look. Were you looking at what I was doing? Yeah. I'm nervous. I'm actually nervous too. I'm nervous mostly because we're putting this on the internet. For everyone to judge how dumb we are. I feel like I should have practiced. All right, guys. So we have our predictions on these pieces of paper that we are gonna open at the end with our final results. We're putting these in our pockets right now. Okay, the All pockets right. that I... Oh yes, I have pockets. <laughs> now that we're here, I guess there's only one way to legitimately settle this. Let the best man or woman win. <laughs> I'm downstairs, I'm gonna take my test while Gabe does it upstairs because we cannot take any chances of him hearing me or me hearing him. Although I will say right now, he's not a cheater, but I was thinking he found this link so he had time to prepare if he absolutely crushed it. Now Jess doesn't know this guys, but the current plan is to Photoshop my results at the end to make them different than what they actually are. And then when I show her the results, it just, you know, fake it. Just pull out those acting skills that you saw at the beginning of this video. I will say I'm pretty nervous. I need to not make excuses, but I, my one excuse will be, I feel like I would do really well on this if I had time to prepare. Like things that I can study for and like learn and that I'm prepared for, I feel like I can do well in, but it's the fear of the unknown right now. <sighs> Why am I nervous right now? The start button is waiting for me right here. 20 minutes, 20 questions. That's one minute per question. Look at me already. I'm doing so good. <laughs> All right, here we go. Choose the appropriate shape. A, B, C, D, E, or F to replace the shape. That is missing. What? I have a 20 minute timer, crap. Why do I hate this already? I need to find the similarities. There, there. So there's two, two, two of those, and then there's one and one. There, so what's missing is this one, because that would be an, an equal to this. What the heck is going on? I've already gone over a minute. I'm just gonna click that. <laughs> Dude, I'm so confused. Choose the appropriate shape to replace the missing shape. I'm so dumb. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. It's gotta be that one. Nothing big, small. One, two, three. Up, double, triple. <sighs> what the heck? Sideways, double, triple. I actually have no idea. Down, double, triple, four. Oh my gosh, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. I literally just felt like a detective. What? <laughs> Small circle, medium triangle, big square. Okay, I think I understand. Small triangle, medium square, big circle. So it's gonna be a triangle. What triangle? Small square, medium circle, big triangle. That one's already on there, you know what I mean? Okay, I'm gonna do that one. Left, down, right. Down, down, right, right, left, left. Three, down. Down, 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 surely. There's all just shapes, what the heck? This one is just too much is going on already. My brain can't even like compute. This reminds me of, you know those things that you would fold and do that with one two three four five one two three four one two three one two three four one two three four one two three four holy moly straight straight angle no dude i have no clue this one actually i like my brain can't even focus on it i think i'm just gonna have to guess this one dude i just have to guess on that one boom i don't know sorry these look like drier instructions there we go. three triangles that's easy. That one, I can compute. I'm so dumb, this is so difficult. Choose the appropriate shape, A, B, C, D, if there's a place the one that's missing. Uh, what does this mean? That way, across. If I look at this like it's a clock. The lines go like that. Dun, 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 dun. So there's gonna be up. Which means it's gonna be one of these top ones. And now the circle is going 
dum dum rivet that way. One, two, so it's gonna be up with the circle on that side. Beep boop! It's gotta be this one. One, three, four, plus three. Okay. Plus three is 10, plus three is 13, plus three is 16, 19, 25. 25! I can do maths. One, two, one, one, two. Initially, my brain thinks it's C, because if you look at this middle one, they've kind of like flipped diagonally. Diagonally. Harry Potter. Beep boop! Boom, boom, boom. There. And then one and a half. Boom, boom, boom. I get it. Okay, I understand this. This has got to be it. Circle, square, triangle. Circle, square, triangle. That's square. Square. Dum, 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 dum. Easy. Uh, 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 uh. This one seems way too easy. Are these getting easier? Mm, 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 mm. Oh, gotcha. I'm going to just say that is 12 o'clock. Four plus one equals five plus two equals seven. Four, five, seven. Okay. Oh no. Four plus one equals five plus two equals seven. No. Four plus one is five, plus two is seven, plus three is ten. Okay, that doesn't work. Seven plus three does not equal eleven. They are all odd numbers except the four. I don't know if that does anything. Four plus one equals five. Then five plus that one plus that two. No. Eleven plus nineteen. Nope. What is happening? Oh my gosh, what the? Seven plus double that number equals a 19. Four plus five does not equal seven. That doesn't work, that doesn't work. Four times five does not equal seven. There's a pattern here I'm missing. What is the connection here? Four times 1.2 equals five. Then five times Round the red track there. This is, I have to guess. I think I figured it out. This is so frustrating. Okay, the difference between these two is one. The difference between these two is two. The difference between these two is four. The difference between these two is eight. Which means the difference between these two is gonna be 16. They're like kind of doubling-ish. I'm gonna go to high 200s. Which means the difference between these two is going to be 32. 64. I just got butterflies because I figured it out. 259. We're each going down one. Oh, it's the whole shape. Beautiful. That seems pretty self explanatory. <laughs> Not another one of these. The difference is one. The difference is two. The difference is three. 32 minus four is 28. 28 minus five. 23. The difference is 6, the difference is 7. 10 minus 8 is 2. 2. Correct. Nailed it! I'm sweating. I'm like, my palms are a bit sweaty. He's weak. Mom spaghetti! 1, 3, 1, across. Ah, ha, ha, it's going this way. 1, 2, which makes me feel like it would be this one. 1, 2, 3, over this end. 1, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2. 3, I like that. Okay, let's do it. 3! Last one, guys. <laughs> I'm seeing the pattern. <laughs> I'm thinking it would be this one. <laughs> Correct. I'm done. <sighs> We've accurately determined your IQ score. See how to retrieve it below. We have to pay money. They've got us. I'm nervous. Oh. Oh my gosh. We have my test score. <sighs> oh my gosh. I bet Gabe did so good. We're totally gonna fake just out here. I found this font that looks pretty similar to the font they're using on the website to be safe and make sure that I'm below her. She's smart, she's a smart girl. I'm probably gonna go with like, let's go 78. I showed Jess this screen. Let's go, baby, let's go. All right, I'm upstairs in our guest bedroom after taking the test. I just finished it, but Jess apparently had to feed the baby in the middle of everything that she was doing. So in the meantime, I think I'm just gonna Take a nap while we all wait for Jess. I'm done. She's done. Yoo-hoo. You done? Yeah. Well, let's show each other these results after I took that nap. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm nervous. All right, we're back. I'm nervous too, actually. One thing that made me nervous was the timer. Right? It's sitting there just ticking and ticking, and it just it was getting in my head so much. I thought, okay, great. I have 20 minutes to finish these. I can like take my time or really think about it. Then I thought they probably calculate your IQ based on also how long you take. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
But then second, I think because I was also filming at the same time and I know everyone's watching me take this test. Oh, it got in my head so much. Yeah. Like, I feel like I may have been able to do a few points higher if the camera wasn't filming me. Same. Let's do our predictions first and then see how we stacked up. My prediction for myself was 90. 90? I put 108 for you. Oh, wow. What was yours for yourself? 110. Oh, so... Okay, just Remember? a little bit lower. Well, you said I'm two years younger, so yeah. I was like, okay, two. So two I put... <laughs> I put 114. Oh, really? Because I think the top of the average you said was 115. Yeah. I didn't know how hard this test was going to be. So I'm I was like, just right at the top of average. I put myself at the bottom of average. <laughs> you did well, didn't you? No, I didn't. What's yours? No, I don't want to go. Just say it. You go first. You want me to go first? Should we turn at the same time? Yeah. Three, Three two, two, one. one. <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> You are so much smarter than me. I was not ex I said 90. Jessica. I don't know what to say. I will say some of these questions made me feel like a detective, which is kind of like my inner, you know, dream. So maybe that just came out in me. Okay, well, look, I do have a confession to make. You've taken it before. That was fake. What did you actually get? You're still smarter than me. Oh my gosh, my guess was so close. You were two away. Why'd you Photoshop that? Because I thought it'd be funny. <laughs> I'm shocked at how high you got. What? You realize you're borderlining like the 1% genius. of genius, which like I knew you were going to be smart, which was why I was debating putting you higher than me. But you're like very much smarter than me. Very much smarter. To see a similar video where we agree or disagree on very juicy statements slash questions about our relationship, you can click right here. Not going to lie, during filming this video, I almost questioned our whole relationship. <laughs> see Bye. ya.